A house fire in Washington County, Tennessee claimed one person's life. Thanks for joining us for News 5 at 6. I'm P.J. Johnson. And I'm Julie Newman. Officers say crews were dispatched around 6 o'clock this morning to a house on Shipley Road. News 5's Courtney Lester joins us now from our Johnson City Newsroom with more on what happened. Courtney. Julie, I was at the scene earlier where the smell of smoke lingers in the air. Neighbors are still shaken up by what unfolded. One neighbor tells me she knew the woman that lived in that house for over 40 years. I can't bear to think about anyone having to die that way. Neighbors felt helpless as they saw the house swallowed by flames. There was nothing I could do, but it just scared me to death because I knew <laughs> that she was in there. When crews got to the scene, described as an inferno, it was too far gone to save the resident. It was a two-story house. The second floor had fell down on the first floor, which had fell down in parts of the, uh, it was like a dugout basement. It was a very old house. Once the house was cooled down? We had to start digging out, trying to find someone in there. And the neighbor's worst nightmare came true. After a long, long time, they found her in there. According to neighbors, an elderly woman lived in the house alone. I can't bear to think about anyone having to go that way. It's, it's just not good. The body was taken to Quillen College of Medicine for formal identification and autopsy. Washington County Sheriff's Department officials say investigating the cause of the fire has been turned over to the state fire marshal, which is standard procedure. Getting the facts right in Johnson City, I'm Courtney Lester, News 5 WCYB.